All right, first pie guy here. You're looking at uh, three RTL SDR.com V3 dongles. Uh, now, these are the real deal. Uh, I see a lot of people online, they fall for the uh, knockoff fake ones. Uh, so I figured maybe I can uh, make a little video of what to kind of look for. The, for the real one versus the uh, fake one. Obviously, we can see here we have the name of it and some other information here. V3, and we have some uh, stamped information down there. One of the things with all the uh, RTLSDR.coms that I ever got, it'll have this little paper sticker here on the back of the date and the month. And as you can see, they all have them. Now this one here is the newest one that I got. And this one here is stamped off November 2020. And they added a little bit more information on the back, which is nice. That will definitely help people to uh, distinguish between the real and the fake. But uh, as you can see here, they added this information here. Versus the older ones, which is from 2016 and 2018. <clears throat> so, that's pretty nice. Another thing is, the real one will only have two screws. The fake one will have four screws. And other than this housing being a little beveled. It will be straight across. It won't have this curve to it. And like I said, it'll have the two screws. And if we open up one of these. Let me open up one of these older ones. It'll be a greenish type color board <clears throat> and I believe the fake one is uh, a yellowish type color so that's another thing to look for so if we pull this guy out as you can see it's a greenish circuit board and you'll have this little uh, heat type heat tape it's kind of a little bit sticky. But that's what the real one will look like. You'll have some uh, connect pins here that you can solder some stuff to. Now, <clears throat> to the fake one, we're just going to pull this up online. There's what the fake one will look like. See, you see the V3. But it's missing the .com and obviously some of the other information. Nothing on the back. And as you can see, it has the four screws. And this is flat and not got a bevel on it. <clears throat> but they wouldn't want so much for one of these because it's weird. The fake one costs more than the real one. And I would get one, but it's kind of a waste of money. Just to get one to compare it. So I figured I'd just look it up online. But uh, that's what the fake one will look like. So you definitely want to stay away from that guy. And don't fall for it. And make sure you get the real deal. Go to their website and get it. Or get it on Amazon. <clears throat> and make sure that it's sold from the RTL SDR blog company. And not fall for one of these because <clears throat> I'm not quite sure if this supports bias T and this guy does simple command or whatnot can turn that on and off so hopefully this kind of helps out thanks for watching stay tuned for another one and don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe